In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, load values into your accumulators and registers using the load commands. So the first thing we I'm going to show you is how to load a value into accumulator A. To do that, type LDAA space, put a pound sign, and uh, followed by the number you want to load into the accumulator. I'm going to load the value 34 in hexadecimal. So load the value 34 in hexadecimal into accumulator A. Let's go ahead and run the code. Notice that uh, before I run it, A has a value CB. Now let's run the program. And the value has changed to 34. Like it says in my code. Now let's uh, load a value into the accumulator B. So L D A B. And I'm going to load the value 67 in hexadecimal. So we're going to load B with the value 67 in the hexadecimal. So let's run the program. A and B have the values CB. Let me hit F5 to run the program. And now A has a value 34 and C has a value 67. Like it says in my code. Also notice that uh, accumulator D has a value 3767 and the reason for that is that if we go to our data sheet or the HCS12 you're going to see that D is actually A and B put together so A has 34 B has 67, that's why D is 3467. Like it says in the um, data sheet. So B has 8 bits, A has another 8 bits, D has 16 bits. Now let's uh, load a value directly into accumulator, into uh, accumulator D. To load a value into D, it's LDD. There's no A in between the Ds, it's just LDD. And I'm gonna load D with the value 4589. So I'm gonna run the program. And this time I'm gonna run the program line by line, so that's F11. So you can see what happens. So check the values of A, B, and D as they will be changing. So A is 34, D is 34 CB, B is 67, D is 34 67. Now D is 45 89 and A are 45 and B is 89 so uh, to change the value of D you can load a value into A and B and also to change the values of A and B you can load a value into D so this part of V goes to A this part goes to B just like it says in the picture now let's uh, load some values to the registers X and Y And X has a value 90, 88. Y has a value 77, 33. 
So this is how you load values into your accumulators and registers. Now lastly, uh, the reason why I'm using four hexadecimal numbers to load registers D, X, and Y is because register accumulator D, register X, and Y have 16 bits each. And as you should know, each number in hexadecimal has four bits. So we have four, eight, 12, 16. Accumulators A and B only have eight from zero to seven each. And that's why we only use two numbers since 4 plus 4 is 8 